It launched Jamie Jury's career and gave us movies like Magic Mike, but male dancers, who may or may not have any clothes on, have had to find new ways to entertain their audience during these COVID times. And while they might not be able to dance on stage to a wild screaming audience, they can instead come to your home, virtually at least. Carlos and Will are two dancers with the Magic Men show and join us now via Zoom. G'day, guys. Now, first of all, Will, I have to say, you look so much like Channing Tatum. It's incredible. Does that work for you? I've definitely been milking it, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> definitely helped to be in this industry. But, um, yeah, you've got to take it as a compliment. There's worse people I could be compared to, that's for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. So, Carlos, tell us how you've had to adapt your show. What, what takes place in a virtual show? So basically, you know, with the whole COVID thing, really did have a massive effect on our business and our industry. We weren't able to perform. So, you know, me and Will one day just had a bit of a brainstorm and we thought, you know, it would be such a great idea if we could, you know, take this online and have all the people who had hen's nights and birthdays cancelled still have an opportunity to connect with us. So it was an idea and I think it actually worked. So, yeah. Wow, I've got to say, but doing it uh, virtually, uh, you really don't get that audience impact and that, that whole buzz. Uh, so you've really got to really be incredibly good at performing. So how does it impact on you? Yeah, it's, it, was, it was hard to adapt to um, performing to a camera because obviously our show is very interactive and mm. we're used to having the girls screaming or even jumping up on stage with us. So, yeah, it was a bit of a change doing it in front of a camera. But, yeah, we just had to adapt. First just, couple of shows. Do you, find the yeah, women, yeah. do you find the women often end up trying to stick $5 notes into their computers? <laughs> <laughs> They're probably throwing cash at the mm, screen. Yeah. We, get the, uh, we get all the emojis now. So we'll get all the eggplants. Yeah, instead and... of the cheering. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was going to say, just broaden the uh, interactive aspect of your show that you're missing. Basically, I think what it is now, I think the interactions now from us is, you know, the, basically the responses that we get online and then the messages that we get from these girls after the show, mm. just thanking us for, you know, making their Saturday night because that's when we do our shows every the, Saturday night. Can you see the people watching you at home? Sometimes we do. We sometimes do screen shares. And yeah, sometimes we, we let um, birthday girls and people who were supposed to have their bachelorette parties like join with us, so it's like a split screen so we can see their reaction while we're doing the show. So you haven't really put on the, the COVID weight a lot of other people um, perhaps <laughs> have. Uh, how have you been keeping fit? Um, just been doing home workouts, yeah. Great um, lighting. Yeah. Great lighting. <laughs> and Great yeah, lighting. we've got the spotlights to rely on now that we're doing the virtual shows. <laughs> Keeps you inspired. Um, look, we, we thought this sounded like a great way to make money, and, and CAC in particular, Kerry Ann, my fellow host, gave it a bit of a go during the ad break. Can you guys have a look and sort of give, give a rating out of, out of 10 on how you think she'd go doing a bit of a virtual, virtual thing on, online? Well, you know, that looks very well uh, choreographed. Looks like we've got some new members. I know. <laughs> Everyone's hey, going to hey. <laughs> including our cameraman Herman. What do you think? Has yeah. Studio Ten got the got the goods to to do a virtual show of our own? Definitely, definitely. definitely. That's what we try and do. You got to not take yourself too seriously when you're doing this. <laughs> Well, I think that is mighty fine advice. Now, to book a spot to see the virtual Magic Men show this Saturday night, head to magicmen.com.au. Will and Carlos, thank you so much for joining us today. Thanks thank for having you. us. Thanks for having us. See you on the now, stage, Jess. How, how much is that again? If you go to Magic Men, how much does it cost? It's, it's, it's just, uh, just three, uh, three easy payments. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> And free postage and handling, Kat. Yeah. It's, um, yeah, look, the, the, the actual amount is discretionary, but they do ask no coins. <laughs> Your Saturday night is sorted, Kat. Coming up, the secret to perfect butter chicken from the great nephew of its creator. <laughs> but next, more...